What's the range? We're going to have contact now. We have contact. We have capture. We have capture. Congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations. Everything is uh, showing here as well. Perfect. I was worried I didn't want to go back. <laughs> uh, so we continue. Yes, please continue. Mike, Gennady. This is Mission Control in Kuryov. Uh, docking confirmed uh, just as we were moving into range of Russian ground stations. Docking confirmed at uh, 8.05 a.m. Central Time, 4.05 p.m. Moscow Time. As uh, the two spacecraft passed over central Kazakhstan, just south of the capital city of Astana. Again, the docking confirmed at 8.05 a.m. Central Time, 4.05 p.m. Moscow Time. New residents have arrived at the International Space Station. A manual docking by Gennady Padaka that occurred about nine minutes ahead of schedule. And uh, the visiting vehicle officer in mission control in Houston reporting to Flight Director Brian Smith that the uh, docking probe has begun to retract to initiate the process of hooks and latches engaging to form a hard mate between the two vehicles. Okay, we're switching to page 85 and performing measurements. All right. Pressure. We have measurements 1606, 17, and Bill. and 7.49 in the orbital. We couldn't read you. We copy. Did you get information on pressure? Yes, and uh, record it, and then you will be comparing the deltas. Do you read me now? Very bad, very faint. How about now? Okay, we'll just continue on page 85. Please do and report. We spent a lot of time on establishing calm. How do you read me now? This is Mission Control Koryadov. Uh, just to recap, uh, Gennady Padalka was uh, directed to take over uh, manual control of the flying of the Soyuz TMA-14 about uh, 200 meters out. After a short station keeping period, he deftly guided uh, the Soyuz uh, the final way and uh, linked up uh, to the aft docking port of the Zvezda service module a few